Hey! Hi guys and welcome back to another one. Guys, I'm currently out <laughs> for a run. So I ended up coming to a park. So I'm just gonna warm up and then I'm gonna go on a run. I don't know how long I'm gonna run for. I'm gonna do a minimum of five kilometers, guys. That's about 3.4 miles minimum. Um, but yeah, I'm still um, under 15 kilometers. That's probably the maximum I run for. I'm still working my way up to like a really, really long run, like a 20 mile run or like a 50 mile run. So I'm still like mastering my five kilometer, my 10 kilometer, um, which is under 10 miles um, in general. So I'm still mastering um those <laughs> that distance but um currently guys i hope you are good you are well um i'm gonna warm up um and then we're gonna go out on the run my last run a lot of you said that i was very very energetic and then you were like where did you get your energy from i'm the kind of person where i do my best to kind of keep a positive mind a positive attitude you know i try to eliminate the negative thoughts that may run through my mind i never want to let a day go by where i'm not laughing i'm not smiling i'm not pushing myself to be a better version of me um so yes i do have my days where i'm just like oh you know i have my days where you know i just don't want to or i procrastinate i'm oh my goodness like god forbid procrastination out of my life because i'm such a procrastinator it's not even funny um but when i get it done i get it done but the procrastination is the enemy in my life right now so i am battling procrastination i am battling the enemy right now um but with that being said guys i'm out and about um i'm gonna go on the run and then after that if i've got some energy left i'm gonna go into the gym and then go and do some strength training so yeah so this is my cardio and then go and do strength training because i do find that mixing and matching your workout really does help with um you're running a bit you're running like four men you know all of that good stuff but as we're here let's get stretching i'm gonna do a couple of drills probably stretch for about 10 15 minutes just to get my heart rate going and then we're gonna go out okay <laughs> I hope you guys are enjoying the drills and also guys if you are new to the channel and you haven't subscribed make sure you subscribe to the channel um, that you share you comment and uh, yeah if you are enjoying the running vlog subscribe if you want to see more let me know and put your notification bells on so you can always be notified whenever I drop content and then you can come you can rush to the channel don't forget guys you can super chat me as well okay super chat your girl if you think I'm doing a good job okay okay <laughs> super chat me so you know I can improve my content you know I still need to get a camera still need to get a camera so yeah super chat me okay super chat me if you can It's my first 1k um my current pace is 712 which is absolutely fine because i don't know how long i'm gonna run for i'm gonna do a minimum of 5k but i also um i wanna i wanna go quite a long way if i can get to 10k today i'll be happy i'm gonna aim for five for my goal, I'm gonna aim for five 
but my goal is 10 um so yeah 12 7 12 i'm gonna keep it at that just so i can monitor my breathing so i'm not thinking about pace too much i'm just thinking about being focused and not giving up so let's go guys at this point i feel a bit dizzy so i'm just gonna walk because also disclaimer i'm not feeling too great and i'm out on the run by myself so as i'm by myself i need to take care as well so i'm just gonna walk here until my head doesn't feel so light anymore okay okay and then we're gonna resume and it's getting warmer as well so yeah so it's getting warmer so and my head feels really light so i'm just gonna have to take it easy because i'm by myself on the run so gotta look after myself you know so if i was with someone then obviously i can hold my hand um that can make sure that I'm okay, that I'm breathing and everything, but I've got to pause. And it's okay to pause sometimes, because the last thing you want to do is have an accident and there's nobody around to help you. So, yeah. Okay, let's resume. Hi guys, so I ended my workout on seven kilometers. Yeah, so, um, yeah, so I ended my workout at seven kilometers. Guys, I am tired, but I'm okay actually um i just don't have any more like um what do you call it i don't have any more uh distance to go and i don't want to keep going around the loop and i'm also thinking about the time because i want to go and work out at the gym and do a bit of weight training so i've done my cardio for the day i did seven kilometers so i burnt about 500 calories which is i don't calorie count but it's starting to get quite, it's starting to get quite warm now so i don't really want to be out running in the heat um, I don't really have any drink as well, so I'm just going to walk to the car. But yeah, I enjoyed my run this morning. I came out quite early um, before traffic, before people. So yeah, i um, just going to walk back and stretch at the same time. Um, but yeah, guys, if you are new to the channel and you haven't subscribed, make sure that you do. You subscribe to the channel, you like, you share and you comment. So I'm just um, heading to the gym now. Um, I actually feel really, really good. I wish I could have done a bit more. Um, I wish I could have done my 10K, but um, I didn't want to keep going around the loop. And this was kind of like not my most familiar running route. So yeah, and the distance that I thought seemed longer in my mind when I came to do this route um, was actually not that long. Um, and I just, I just didn't want to go around in the loop. So I like when I go running guys, one of the things that I do really enjoy running is discovering new area. So I like running and then I get to a new area and then I get to a new area. And then um, usually it's like, if you drive around, you know the driving route, but sometimes you find the pathways as well so i enjoy running and discovering like new areas that i wouldn't usually go to i wouldn't usually walk to because it's just not on my it's not on my route it's not on my way i don't need to be there but when you run you you want to kind of see different areas because you get different scenery you know you can do city run you can do country run you can do park run you can do um neighborhood run all runs of fun and explorative so so anyway let's head to the gym now and um continue with the workout and then that'll be the end of today's workout okay? mm -hmm. 